Tell us about the bandwidth demands in this new era of streaming video. Sure. Um, well, Level 3 Communications, uh, we have an, a business unit that is positioned around the content providers and content and consumers of content. And what we're seeing is explosive growth. Uh, customers that are buying high-speed IP from us to build out their own networks and to push their own video and then now with our introduction of CDN services and we saw that as a natural product extension um, because this with the explosive demand for streaming and for video and also software downloads and other applications um, such as software at the edge the increasing need for bandwidth is growing and growing and growing and the proliferation of broadband users makes it easier and easier for people to do it. Level 3 has, has been around as a, um, as, a, as, a, as a largely as web hosting historically or tell us a little bit about the history and how you guys got to this point. Level 3 started in 1998 and we've built and owned and operated our own backbone. Um, originally focused on and have been traditionally focused on being a wholesale provider of bandwidth services, everything from dark fiber all the way up to providing application services such as voice over IP for carriers, for service providers, for MSOs, for wireless companies, um, and large portals and large internet service providers. Uh, we've expanded that product line with CDN services over the past, this past year. We acquired Savvis CDN in January and closed on that and have incorporated that into Level 3's platform. We have a, a focus on segments such as broadcasters, uh, content sourcing, so those that are actually creating the content, uh, large portals, user-generated content site or social networking sites, and the benefit here is that all those customer, all those segments are our customers today. So these, they're, they're buying some sort of a building block for building their own network to be able to distribute content and video or their or high speed IP and now they can buy content delivery network services from level three in which we help them for very popular content, very large files, get the content closer to the end user. How do you guys accommodate smaller companies? Uh, within level three we have an entire business unit focused on smaller or enterprise companies and it's our business markets group. And also we have a master reseller program. So we, so where we can't serve a company because they don't fit the, pro, or they're, they're not the size of the company that we would serve directly, we do have master resellers that sell level three services on behalf of level three um, or package it into their portfolio of offerings. So for instance, we have companies that are buying high speed IP from us, which is high speed internet connection and co-location and then they make their own web hosting service offering out of that and package it and sell it. And so in that program we have uh, several large resellers that serve smaller market. I've been doing some searching about uh, CDN services and flash media services and there's a lot of like small companies how do you know when you go to like look on Google and you say you know uh, you know flash media server and they say yeah we'll stream blah 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 for 9.99 or how do you know that these resellers are legit so our resellers we have a master reseller program and they are quote unquote level 3 enabled so it means they are a certified level 3 reseller and level 3 is providing them with marketing support and sales support to help them put together their solutions and help them target the right customers